it was quite touching to me that it, um, in some African countries it gets that deep where you find yourself leaving your home where you're supposed to be feeling safe and loved just to get away from being violated. Um, we hope for it to be eradicated. Yes, some of the traditional leaders will say tradition, culture, but our human rights don't agree with that. And I believe if God made us the way that we are, who are we to come and modify um, our, our physical beings? Um, in Lesotho, however, we don't have um, mutilation. With regards to child marriage, it does exist. It's very strong. It used to be okay customarily back in the day, but it soon was also um, legally eradicated. So it, it happens in such a way that you get abducted. Um, it's called, in, in our language, it's called Hoshubedis. They basically steal you from your home and then the man keeps you at his house, but only informs your parents after that that you are there and he's going to make you his wife. Um, it happens from the ages of 14. Parents also organize for these abductions to happen so that the children assist them somehow. So they get married off to men who are well off or rather that can take care of a normal household. Yes. With the power that we have naturally or given, we need to positively work on it and give our communities what they deserve. Um, we need to be leaders who are responsible for our actions and the actions of those around us and to show strength all the time to people and not to give up and not to give in to any of the circumstances that we're being faced with. And with us being strong, it means we show our people that they too can get through it. So if we hold hands together, we can overcome anything. I believe there's nothing that is beyond um, our means. We wouldn't be put in a position of not being able to overcome any storm that will be thrown at us.